Turn the power off to the outlet by tripping the appropriate breaker and testing for power with a non-contact voltage tester or multimeter. Always check the operation of a voltage tester at a known power source prior to use. Remove the cover plate and retaining screws, then pull out the outlet to expose the wiring. Remove the hot, neutral, and ground wires by backing off the terminal screws. Prep the wiring for the new outlet by cutting back any corroded wiring and stripping back roughly one inch of bare copper, then creating a loop for the terminal screw. The neutral white wire connects to the silver terminal screw. The ground bare copper wire connects to the green terminal screw. And the hot black wire connects to the brass terminal screw. Make sure to wrap the loop clockwise around the terminal screw and tighten firmly. This is a 15 amp 125 volt outlet on a single 15 amp circuit. This is the last outlet in the circuit. If changing an outlet in the middle of the circuit, there will be two hots, neutrals, and grounds. They can be connected on the second set of terminals or pigtailed together, then connected to the terminals. Since the second set of terminals are not being used on this outlet, it is best to tighten them down. After that, apply electrical tape to cover the exposed wiring and terminal screws. Push the wiring back into the box. Square the outlet to its surroundings and tighten the retaining screws. Once secure, install the new cover plate. 
Careful not to over tighten as the plate may crack. The final steps are flipping the breaker back on and testing the outlet. Hello fellow DIYers, I hope this video helped you out and possibly save you some time and money. If you like videos like this one, feel free to subscribe. Tap our logo and hit the subscribe button. This will keep you updated on all our newest content. And remember folks, never stop learning.